Dave? Jose, uh, congrats, first of all. Just Thank a, you. A couple for you. First of all, is your game catered to an all-star type of atmosphere? <laughs> I mean, yeah. I, I mean, I'm from New York. You know, that's a, I feel like that's an all-star every time you play in the park. So um, it was just an atmosphere I enjoyed. I think, uh, you know, I just play Jose basketball. And just another notch to your story. You come into the league undrafted. You're sharing the court with, yeah, number three pick, number two pick. Number, you know, uh, just what does it mean to you to be included with the guys that I guess got more recognition coming into the league? I mean, it's dope. You know, we went in our locker room and we never, we didn't look at no numbers though. Um, we just came in and said we're on the same team. Let's go win this. I think everybody was on the same board. So um, I just had a really great, great group. You know, um, and um, I'm happy they my teammates and we won. Right here, the microphone on the second row. Hi, Yo, I really won MVP. That's crazy, right? <laughs> Hi, Christina. How you doing? Uh, what can you tell your Latin fan base about winning, about playing in the All-Star and winning MVP? Oh, man. Um, um, shout out to them, man. They show so much love. I've seen the billboards. Thank you. And um, I appreciate them so much. You know, I can't wait to go back to PR and, and, and all around and just show so much love to them. Huh? Sorry, what you said? Can you tell us something about your Mexican heritage? Is it true that you have Mexican relatives? Yes, um, my mom is Puerto Rican and Mexican, and, um, and my daughters are half, so they're Puerto Rican and Mexican. So, uh, yeah, we Mexican family, we all over. Next question over here on this right side. Uh, congrats again, Jose. Uh, just three years ago, you were at Georgia Tech playing against uh, Morehouse College, and now you're the MVP of the Rising Stars game. Uh, how does this, how do you contextualize all this from where you came from? I mean, I really, I really can't put in no words, you know. I think this is just something like, I lie to y'all. I, I would lie. Hold up, mom. I'm talking, okay? I would, I'd be lying if I say I had this in my mind. You know, I believe in myself 100%. I think I, I believe in myself out of this world. But um, this is something I, I ain't even think of or even dream of. So um, for me to just do this and accomplish this from, you know, Georgia Tech days and all that, it just, you know, built in my, my journey. My mom. All right, cool. Over here in the second row. Jose, I couldn't even get into my seat before you had a full court in, inbounds steal pickoff. It's just no mercy with you. Nah, nah. I'm even in an myself. exhibition game. Yeah, yeah. Where's that come from? You know, just being myself. I think, but our team, you know, set the principle. You know, we wasn't going to go out there and try to win. You know, we wasn't going to try to be too cool because you know, you know, people. And it's a game that you want to be, you know, show your skills and stuff like that. But um. You know, we, we want us to enjoy all this, you know, enjoy the atmosphere, enjoy the winning, and then, you know, going out there and say we did something. On your left, third row. Can you describe your defense on uh, Grimes going down the stretch? He, he didn't know if that was illegal. <laughs> <laughs> it might have not been, but, uh, man, he was shooting. He was doing good. You know, uh, we had to get him. If, if he kept going there, they probably would have won the game. So, um, you know, they put me on him, so then they miss a few shots, and we win. Any other questions around the room, please raise your hand. I appreciate right, y'all. Thank you. Thank you.